right. Let me tell you about my family. Hey, here we go now. It's that time again. Let's take a look and see what's happening. Roller coaster ride. No surprise. It's life with Louie, Louie, Louie. Life with Louie, Louie, Louie. It's life with likable, lovable, completely huggable. It's life with Louie. Everyone has their favorite part of the school day. Mine was lunch. Sure, the food wasn't really edible, and the cafeteria smelled like a gym. But you couldn't beat the company. Hey, hey, Louie. Louie. And then one day, the company changed. Who's the Lone Ranger? New kid. Just transferred in. They call him, uh, Sean. And he doesn't even spell it with an H. Hi, Sean. Hey, what's Jeannie doing? She doesn't even know that guy. Sure she does. They met in math class. She sat next to him. Probably had no choice. Probably the only seat left. Louie, toddler, Grunwald. I want you to meet my friend, Sean. Hi, Sean. Nice to meet you. You mind if Sean eats with us? No offense, but there's just not enough room here. That's right. Louie likes to change seats after every course. That's all right. This one's fine. Just watch. Next thing you know, he'll be asking us to share our lunches with him. I got this guy's number. I got extra cookies. Anyone want one? What number was that, Louie? Hey, Jeannie. You need some help? I can carry your books. Thanks, Louie. That's sweet, but Sean already offered. Sean? You're still coming over, aren't you? I was going to teach you how to do a wheelie on your bike, remember? I'd love to, Louie, but... You ready, Jeannie? See you tomorrow, Louie. Whatever. Hold on tight! <laughs> hey, take it easy! Slow down! <laughs> I couldn't believe it. Jeannie and I had been best friends since the beginning of time. If this kid thought he could move into my town and steal the love of my life, he was wrong. He was nuts. He was trying to win her with really dangerous. Well, I wasn't going to let her go without a fight. I needed a plan. And then, fate provided one. Valentine's Day! All right! If this doesn't get her, nothing will. Uh, Jeannie, I just want to say... <laughs> hey, Jeannie, look! Oh, my. Oh, wow, check it out! Of Sean. Sure. There, that ought to do it. That's the greatest Valentine anyone's ever given me. Is Sean neat or what? Oh, yeah, he's the neatest. He's nifty. Be my valentine, Susie. Michael, you're the thoughtfulest. Yeah, I know. I gotta go. I'm gonna be late for band practice. All right, maybe I'll see Sean, you after... Sean, wait up! Happy Valentine's Day, Jeannie. Here, Mom. Happy Valentine's Day. Oh, Louie, you shouldn't have. Don't get too excited. Bad day. Mom, how'd you make Dad like you? Oh, Louie, you can't make anyone like you. It just happens. Well, how did you and Dad happen? It was a warm July night in old Chicago. I had just moved to town. That should do it. What do you guys want to do now? Anyone up for some gin rummy? We've got a better idea. Oh, you sure you wouldn't rather play cards? I could bake something. Oh. Uh -huh. And that's when I heard it. It wasn't just the music. It was the most romantic sound I'd ever heard. It was Dad, right? Who? Oh, your father. Uh, well, he was there, too. Oh, oh, so cute. Oh, 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 I've got shivers. Oh, oh. Thank you, Bobby. And now, just back from overseas, please give a warm welcome to the Army Men. Oh, oh, oh. Get this guy out of here. Come on. Uh, uh, thank you very much. We can feel your love. <laughs> All right, hit it, fellas. Whoops! Forgot to purge the old spit valve. Hey, be careful! Oh, my mistake. And that's when I knew I had just met the man I was going to marry. This one's for the little lady down in front, the one with the <laughs> soggy pumps. Hit it, boys! And six months later, on February 27th, we were married. Great story, Mom. 
Let me count the ways it helps me. Uh, one, two, three, none. La, 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 mm. la, 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 Hey, down in front. Dad, how'd you convince Mom to marry you? What are you talking about? Look at this face. You think she needed convincing? So, you want to know how I met your mother? Have a seat there, Lily. A seat? Oh. Could I just have the short version? Uh, St. Louis in the 1940s. Mom said it was Chicago. Ah, uh, the city's a city. It was a blustery winter night. Mom said it was summer. Hey, who's telling this story? Me and my boys are finishing up yet another sold-out tour of the continental U.S. of A. We were just about to call it a night when... This one's for the lovely lady who just walked in. Wanna dance? I'd be honored. Wait a minute! What about... Did you really dedicate that song to me? You know it, Dolphin. Dance? Love to. Dad? Dad? Uh, Dad? Dad? Uh, what? Huh? Uh, uh, where was I? Oh, yeah. Anyway, six months later, me and your mother got married. I'll never forget that date. February 28th. Mom said it was the 27th. Ah, oh, what does she know? Was she there? Music, Louie. I'm telling you, the key to a woman's heart is music. Finally, useful advice from Dad. Well, there's a first time for everything. So I joined the school band. I knew it would just be a matter of days before Jeannie recognized my natural gift. And then she'd be mine. Stop, 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 stop! People, what is this noise? My ears! They bleed the blood of a thousand men. You, three trumpets from the top. Louis! Stop, 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 stop! How was it? It was like uh, the sound of a million chalkboards <gasps> being scratched by a million fingernails for a million days. Well, thanks. Do I get a solo? Uh, perhaps uh, the trumpet is not your instrument, Louis. Uh, you come see me during lunch. Lunch? That's my best class. The clarinet. You could be like uh, the great Benny Goodman. Make it sing. The trombone. The soul of the brass section. Perhaps you are the next Glenn Miller. Make it sing. Give me three laps, Anderson! Maybe I'm band deficient, Mr. Marini. No, no. There is music inside every child. We just need to find the right instrument to bring it out. Ah! I've got it. The tuba. The giant anchor on the great ship, Melody. Mm. I think your giant Melody anchor just crunched my spleen. You're still holding it. That's good enough for me. Now, take your tuba home. Practice... Prakatis, prakatis. Just what I needed in life, another burden. Hey, Jeannie, wanna come over and practice? Oh, Sean. Bubby oh. Tuba, can't fit through the door. <laughs> Why don't they just give me a baby grand to take home and practice? Wow, if it isn't my little music man. Yeah. Well, your little music man's going to bed. Aren't you forgetting something? Practice. You gotta practice your instrument. You can't rely on my musical chromosomes all your life. All right. A one and a two and a... <gasps> What's the problemo? 
I don't hear any tuba in. I'm trying. Come on, Louie, you just got to blow. I am blowing. Keep going. You'll get it. Uh. <sighs> Sounds pretty good in there, tuba boy. Time to work on your win, kid. Hey, guys, wait up. Louie was there. He'll tell you. Where was I? In band today. Didn't you hear Sean's solo? It was great. Tell him, Louie. You know, he improvised the whole thing. He's amazing. He's brilliant. He's he's gifted, don't you think? That's Sean, all right. Greatly gifted. What a huge, colossal gift. A one, and a two, and a blow! When you're done with that, I got a flat spare in the trunk. You believe what you want, Andy, but we got married on February 27th. It was the 28th. I remember it like it was yesterday. What day was yesterday? Sunday. Wrong. Yesterday was Monday. All right. So I remember it like it was the day before yesterday. Why does our marriage certificate say February 27th? City Hall got it wrong. It was the 28th, and that's that. Don't tell me I don't know the day I got married. I don't forget my anniversary. I'm more accurate than the farmer's almanac. Andy, excuse yourself. Now that's what I call music. All right. Yes, 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 beautiful. It is like a chorus line of angels dancing in my brain. Now, do not forget concert this Friday night. Louis, we must chit-chat, you and I. What's up, Mr. Marini? Louis, I am filled with a proudness for you. And that is why I want you to have this. What is that? Your tuba solo for Friday night. A solo? Wait a minute. It's only one note. Ah, but no one else will be playing. And that, my little Azalea Bush, is what makes it a solo. And I want you to play the sunset, Louis. For one note, that'll be the shortest sunset in history. Oh, great. As if living next to the guy isn't enough. I had no idea you were such a music lover. You kidding, Jensen? Music's in my blood. Well, I wish you'd keep it there. I've heard you singing in the shower. Ugh. <laughs> Yeah. I'm nervous I might not stay awake until we get to my note. Well, I am. My whole family came. They can't wait to hear Sean Solo in the second piece. They're in for a treat, don't you think? Take your seats, my little prodigies. It is time to share your genius with the world. Genie had one thing right. Everyone was definitely in for a treat. Oh, there he is. But it wasn't going to be a saxophone improvisation in the middle of the second song. That's the one I told you about. I mean, let's face it. How hard is it to improvise anyway? You're just making it up as you go. Mm-hmm. <laughs> 
Encore, Encore. Play that one again, Larry. That's my boy. Fog Garn Anderson, they call him. <laughs> oh, that kid's brilliant. Here he is, Mr. Louis Armstrong. Get in, kid. We'll give you a ride home. <laughs> Louis, you played very nicely. Yeah, everyone was talking about your solo. You guys go ahead. I'm gonna walk. Are you sure, Louis? Uh, leave him alone, dear. Uh, you know, these artist types, uh, they need uh, their space. On the way home, I decided it was time for a mercy killing. My musical career had inflicted too much pain on the world, and it was time to put it to sleep. I would never play the tuba again. Can I come out now, Andy? All your horses there, honey. <laughs> What's going on, Dan? Uh, we're celebrating, Larry. Nineteen years ago today, I talked your mom into marrying me. But it's only February 27th. You said your anniversary wasn't until the 28th. Uh, no, Louie. Uh, your mom was right. Our anniversary's on the 27th. You want to know the real key to a woman's heart? Admitting you're wrong. Even when you're not. And what about if you are? Say bye-bye, Dignity. You get down on your knees and you beg the girl to forgive you. Always works for me. All right, honey. Just about ready. Wait. I don't have a gift. Wrong again, tuba boy. Here you go. Read it, learn it, and play it. Tommy, we're ready for ya. Hang on, I'm coming. Over here, boys. All right, buttercup. You can come in now. Oh. Andy. This one's for the little lady down in front. The one with the soggy pumps. Happy anniversary. Hit it, boys. Let me call you sweetheart. I'm in love with you. Let me hear you whisper that you love me too. Keep that love light glowing in your eyes so blue. Let me call you sweetheart, cause I'm in love with you. I knew I had to apologize to the school for what I'd done. But for now, it was time to try Dad's trick. Say bye-bye, Dignity, and beg for forgiveness. Genie! Hey, Genie! Louie? What are you doing here? Do you know what time it is? Yeah. Time for me to do something I should have done hours ago. I wrote you a song. Just listen, please. Genie, I'm sorry about what I did. I wrecked the concert. I flipped my lid. Oh, Genie, try this on for size. Please forgive me. I apologize. Genie, I'm sorry. I was overzealous. I couldn't help it. I was so jealous. Oh, Genie, try this on for size. Please forgive me. I apologize. So, what do you think? <laughs> Louie? Yeah? I just have one thing to say. Genie, telephone. It's Sean. Will you tell him I'll call him tomorrow? I'm kind of in the middle of something here. What were you going to tell me? Just this. Play it again, Louie. Genie, I'm willing to wait in line. If maybe next year you'll be my valentine. Give me three laps, Andrew. 